Hello everyone, Devon here and welcome back to my channel and we're on to season 2 now for our FIFA 23 Burnley career mode boys, we're on to season 2 episode 1 We'll just come to the back of the last episode where we book our places in to the Premier League If you want to see how we did in dramatic fashions, the link will be in the description down below As well as the end of this video so you guys can check that out, definitely give that episode a watch boys We're into the Premier League now which means we have to try and get some decent players in and try and compete in this league and hopefully stay in the Premier League as well boys Hopefully, we get a transfer budget increase. We're going to try and get some new signings into a boost of the squad. Super excited about this. You already know what to do, boys. You want to see more Burnley career mode content. Smash the like button, boys. Hit the like button. Subscribe to you. And let's go ahead and get our season two, episode one of Burnley underway. All right. So, we got promoted into the Premier League, boys. We got a transfer budget increase from 50k, from 50 million to 71 million. We got 20 million for going to the Premier League. That's not that much, boys. That's really not that much, man. I mean, we got offer for Jason Dentney as well. We're gonna have to assess this squad, boys. I have to keep Jason. He's very cheap. I'm gonna have to keep Jason, boys. But we got 71 million to work with. So we're gonna try and get some signings in. As you can see, that's the team we work with from the last season, boys. Um, so I might guess we need a left back because mate team was on loan from Chelsea, so he's gone. So we're going to try and get a left back in, maybe a goalkeeper as well. Um, we definitely need, I'm guessing, another boss, a CDM or CM. Uh, maybe a center back and then maybe a decent striker as well, boys. So five signings with 71 million. We're going to have to try and work with. All right, so let's take a look at our objectives here, boys. Within two seasons, increase your club worth by 30%, okay? Um, and then it says sign at least two players younger than 20 years old with a potential greater than average squad, okay? And sign one player in a youth academy as a defender position interesting finish mid table in the premier league you're having a fucking laugh uh reach around a 16 the emirates have a cup not too bad not too shabby boys get 15 games for at least one goal scored in the league uh may not too bad some of these we should be able to accomplish boys low expectations ish for burnley but let's go ahead and try and fast one and try and get some signings in boys that we're going to help booster up this squad all right so we have scoured the markets boys by searching for some players that either free agent contract expiring in 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 six months or 12 months boys and um some cheap players as well we are scouting a lot of uh, players, boys. I'm going to show you guys the list we have so far. <laughs> uh, I mean, these are, some of these are from last year. Like, Donny Van der Beek will probably try and get as well. Schlager. I mean, this, this is from last season that we're looking at. Still on the ratings, boys. Still on the cards here, boys. But look at this. We went and got a free agents. We are scouting some free agents. But I think that's, that might be the Marcelo's free agent. I'm not sure. Um, left back Brazil and also got this striker who I'm thinking might be Zlatan region, boys. We're going to try and, and scoop this guy up. And then uh, we've got a few center backs. I think one might be Chiellini. I think this might be Chiellini. I'm not sure if it's this one or that one, boys. But this should be Chiellini region, hopefully. And then some left backs that we're looking like. Marino, Aston, for But look at the guy we came across, boys. Locatelli, only going for about 38 million. Of course, I got to go scoop him up. <laughs> it's Locatelli, 84 rated, boys. We're going to try and scoop up our first signing for the first season, boys. Locatelli. <laughs> Big name signing Locatelli. Manuel Locatelli joins from Sassuolo to Brownlee for 35 million. See? That was good price, man. Oh, we could have even got him in for about 28 million. Oh, I freaking messed up. But he improves our mid. Look at the difference between Locatelli, Emmanuel, and Brown Hill, boys. Such a huge difference. <laughs> he improves our midfield right away. We're going to go ahead and get these free agents signing pretty quickly before they expire, boys. And then hopefully, we'll be back to more signings, boys. Let's go and get these free agents done. So we got Locatelli so far, 84 rated. We've got um, Ramos, who's 71 rated for left back. Might be our start already. And then we got 73 rated um, striker and 78 rated center back. That's definitely Chiellini's region, boys. Absolutely love the business so far. So going fast forward and then hopefully we can, we can get we can sell some players in and get decent players in as well, boys. So far, it's looking pretty good for our transfers. All right, so we fast forward now, boys, and we should have our first game come up against um, Aston Villa, I believe, in the league. Uh, so we went ahead and got a few more signings that we took a look at with Scouted, boys. We now have what's the sort of few players as well. So we now have about 34 million left with a few wage budget. But we can try and probably use. I don't think we probably can now for people at 23. Um, but we got 34 million. I think we should probably get a line guy for 24 for a winger. Very, very young. I mean, Rafa is 28, 82 rated, very fast as well. What's that? He's going for his 92 acceleration and 91 sprint speed. A line guy is 90 and 90. And um, so I probably will have to. I mean, there's that of fit we can actually play right wing as well, but he's he means. There he's 29 expensive 20 million uh why not add 4 million trying to get anthony langa boys 
Let's see. Can we buy a Langa? Let's try and get a Langa into the club, boys. Uh, should be a good sign. Anthony Langa signs, bro, for 23 million. <laughs> you never have way too many players. They're not going to notice. They're not even going to notice he's gone. F to C. Could I say 4.6 million? God, I could have gotten for cheaper. All right, so we got Anthony Langa in now, boys. And um, we're looking at a center back. We're probably trying to get a center back. Nia Kat is going for 19 million. It's probably the cheapest we can get. Also, a left back, boys. I need to get a left back in. 19 for this guy. And Meluso is going for five. So let's go ahead and get Meluso in for six million, boys. A decent little backup left back. We we'll definitely need one. So we'll get Meluso in for six million. But so now we got Meluso in. We got a backup left back. And we, we might, he might be the main left back. Honestly, I don't know. We need a backup right. I think we'll go to right back. I think we'll go right back. Hey, yeah, it's an A deal. We'll take those. We'll take those. We'll take those. But decent buy. Decent buy. So now we should now only have about two million left boys so we'll try and see if we can sell anyone and then maybe try and get a center back in what i could do is i could do a swap deal for maybe um Niakate for for jason danaya boys he's 79 rated um i don't know boys i don't know but we'll see what we can do we'll see what we can do let's go ahead and fast forward all right and then we should have aston for that coming up in the premier league boys for our first game to open up the premier league uh, let's take a look at the calendar here, boys, to see what games we have coming up in this episode. So we got Villa coming up, then it's Fulham, and then it's Horse in the Cup. And I tell you what, the opening fixtures are looking kind of easy, boys. They've been very kind to us. <laughs> Yo, they've been very, very kind to us. But we got Arsenal and Chelsea in September, boys. But they've been very, very kind to us. Now we have about 8 million left now in our budget. I was thinking about maybe selling um, Jason Danea and getting the Akata in the club, boys. I don't know why. Um, Niakata kind of looks okay. I mean, if you look at his stats here, he's about 80 rated, I think. Yeah, 80 rated Niakata, boys. About 19 million. Try, maybe we can try and get Niakata in. But I also like Jason Denier, boys. I'm just torn between, man. I don't know what to do. Anyway, what I am going to do is do a sim, boys. We're going to do a sim. Should I play Brian Hill and just keep Mukoko out? I have no idea. Um, let's play Locatelli and Luis Miller, boys. My team is so shy. Anyway, we'll do a quick sim. One your win, get in there. Benson on the score sheets. Benson scores. Manuel Benson still scoring, boys. Oh, wait. Did I did I buy a winger? Anthony Langa didn't start. Oh, crap. I got to edit my team. <laughs> I got to edit my team, boys. I forgot I have Anthony Langa, boys. I got to go ahead and edit my team. All right, boys. And then we now should have a Fulham coming up, boys. Now, a second game in the Premier League. Wait. Arsenal and Man City already going at it in the second fixtures. <laughs> uh, but I'll tell you what. We're going to do a quick sim. Hopefully, we can get a win. I, you know, I kind of want to play that Zlatan's region, man. Let's do B team. Ah, uh, we'll do Vegas, man. We'll do Vegas. I, I need to start playing that region that I got. 2-2 two, two draw, Miller and Mukoko. Andreas Pereira with two goals. Interesting, boys. Interesting. We'll take a 2-2 two, two draw against for him, man. It's, it's, it's for them. It's for them. 2-2 two, two draw. We'll take those. We'll take those. Hopefully, it doesn't um, affect us too much. And I think we should have the cup match coming up against Hull City. And now we should have Hull City coming up in the Carabao Cup. I'm probably doing some of my B team, boys. There he is. B team. Carson, well-rested team. Look at Telly is still playing the B team. Do I, do I not have a CM? Oh, I need a backup right back in the CM, boys. That's what I need now. Go and try and get a backup right back. I should have a backup right back. What am I saying? 4 1 win. And Twine, Jennifer, Brownhill, and Carson as well get in there. Carson, the region scores. 4 1 against Hull City. Talk about, talk about revelations, man. I need to go ahead and edit my team, boys, because I feel like we gotta do, gotta do some some more signings. What the hell is going on? The glitch. My manager has fell. Man is falling. That's not even me. That's AC Milan. <laughs> All right, and now we should now have Crystal Palace coming up as well, boys. We only got one point. Crystal Palace. We got four points. Um, Mateta. We'll do a quick sim against Crystal Palace, boys, just because our B team were knocked from the win. And 3 2 win, they're getting the boys. Brown Hill, Elanga, and Jennifer. Anthony, Elanga. <laughs> Let's go, boys. I'll tell you what, the fixtures have been very kind to us in the opening few games, boys. I am loving it so far. But we're going to try and get uh, this guy in for 8 million as well. Peron. Peron doesn't, doesn't, doesn't look too bad. Try and get Peron in for 8 million. Um, There we go. We should now have this kid in. I think he's about 70 rated. Let's see what, what his rating is. 8 million in for Maximino Peron. 73 rated get 10 that's a decent deal we could have gotten him for cheaper but i'll take that he's 73 rated we'll take that boys we'll take that we'll take that. i wonder how I'm gonna, i wonder how this guy's rating is now uh but listen we got us a backup a backup center back boys a, a backup a backup center mid uh should walk right into our b team for locatelli perfect all right so we fast forward from the transfer deadline day now boys and then we've got at least another coming up in the league that newness just win the blood of the month <laughs> 
interesting. But I want to show you guys. I mean, we got we got a, we got one signing in from the transfer deadline. I end up keeping Jason Danea because why not? I was very very torn between him and Niakate, but it's not really much difference. So I want to keep Jason Danea. I went ahead and got ourselves this kid. I'm um, 20 years of old, Argentine. Maxim Maximo Peron he looks pretty much decent. So that's the kid when I got 73 ratings as well. He's looking very very good. Um, so it's gonna give us a decent um boost hopefully to the squad. But we're gonna go ahead and do a quick sim against Leeds United, boys. Um, why not do a quick sim, man? I mean, I probably should play this game, but it's freaking Leeds. One one. Luis Miller, Mr. Pen. Oh, Louis Miller missed the goddamn penalty. <laughs> wow. Oh, Miller. Miller missed the pen, boss. Oh, gosh. Anyway, let's go ahead and fast forward. Ah, uh, and then now we should have Norwich City coming up as well, boys. Again, I have to do a quick sim against Norwich. I just saw something about us drawing someone that I don't think I have my eyes have seen it correctly. We drew Manchester United in the Carabao Cup. This round three, and we're playing United already, my guy. I tell you what, we're gonna do a quick make against um Norwich, and then we'll play United, Arsenal, and Chelsea to end this first episode, boys. I mean, that's insane, man. Why are we drawing United already? I don't get it. I don't get why we're drawing United. Anyway, let's go and do a quick make against Norwich City. Uh, I do have to do my B team, boys. We have to do the B team now. Yeah, we have to do the B team just because we need to rest our players for the game against United. Two one win, get in there. Ramos red card for Twine and Coppola. Our region center backs. Let's go. <laughs> He's still scoring, boys. Get in there. Things you love to see. And then now we should have a Manchester United coming on in uh, the Copa. I mean, the Carabao Cup, I should say. Our youth scoring reports. Uh, let's go ahead and sign some youth academy players, boys. 94 looks decent. 66 rating. He looks absolutely. 66 potential. He gets some good rounded stats. Uh, may not be a center back, though, but he's got good sprint speed. Um, but reject. Uh, 86 potential reject. 76 potential reject. Um, there we go, boys. We also went ahead and completed our board, our expectations as well for our objectives, boys. Let's go ahead and get Anthony Langa. Get ready for a game against United. <laughs> Things you love to see. I kind of want to play my 4 for 2, boys. Yeah, let's do the 4 for 2. Let's do the 4 for 2. Mukoko, Vegas, Ajana Paul, Luca, Telly, and Miller. Um, Elanga, Meluso, Daniel, Labordi. Already a 79 rated. The Tino and Handanovic, boys. So this guy is in the team. Bruno Fernandez, Jalen Sancho, Canales is in the team as well. Casimiro and Pedri. Es Estolondo. What? Alastondo, I should say. Frimpong, Mancini, Mati. What a team. Why are they going so strong in a Carabao Cup, guys? I don't have enough players to fill the bench. You have Vante Marshall from on the bench. What? What do you mean I don't have enough players to fill the bench? Bro, I've got it. Oh, Twine. There we go. That should do it. All right, let's go and play this game then against a Manchester United boys at Old Trafford in the Carabao Cup round three. All eyes on one man facing his former club. He'll want to make a point live on EA TV. We're passing Anderson to Liska. Why did they got Anderson to Liska in the team? Oh, why didn't I get to Liska in? Oh! Oh, why? Oh, no, it's a goal for United. It's just nine minutes in. We've got him penetrated here by freaking Bruno Fernandes, man. Anderson to Liska into Bruno. Back to Pedri. I mean, they got two more star players in their team. What are they doing, boy? Oh, oh no. Andanovic. This... I should have gotten a better goalkeeper. I, I should have gotten a better goalkeeper than Adanovic. Tries to in. Oh, I mean, that, I mean, he doesn't even try to save it. I don't even know what to do with that one, boy. So that one won in less than 10 minutes. No. Bruno. Yes, Lombardi. Lombardi. Good play. Luis Miller. Oh, Antony Langa. Ooh. Bang. No celebration. No, 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 no. I was trying not to celebrate. I was trying not to celebrate, but he doesn't care. He celebrates against his former club United on the break. United have been caught, caught on a break there by, Bra by Burnley, boys. What a hit. And David Dahi has stood no chance with a power shot there from Anthony Langan as he scores on his return at Old Trafford to give Burnley the equalizer, boys. 1-1 one, one in this game. It's game on. Buying Locatelli from um, Sassuolo for that cheap is probably the, the scoop of the season. Fernandez, Pedri. 
Oh, how is he not offside? And it's a goal for United. Andanovic cannot save anything. <laughs> it comes from Canales, boys. Oh, Meluso. Is that Meluso I'm playing? It is, it is Meluso, boys. It's absolutely gash it up there. We've gotten stitched up there by United again with a lovely finish by Meluso. It's now 2 1 lead for United. What happened there? One touch. Oh, he. Why is it no one tracking? Why? Meluso is putting his hands up for offsides when he should be tracking his runner. So back up uh, into Genepo. Come on, Jenna. Come on, Jenna. Oh, Genepo doesn't seem too fast. What's going on with Genepo, boys? He doesn't seem too fast, man. He's got 80 pace. No wonder why. Let's get let's get Manu I in. Uh, I didn't put I didn't put the, the Oh there he is. There he is. Carson in for Vegas. Carson's got 82 pace. Oh, I don't know yet, boys. Oh, no, let's go ahead and try Vergos. We got our first corner kick, and I'm about to sub out Vergos. What an L manager. <laughs> we got our very first ever corner kick, and I was just about to sub out Vergos, man. There he is, the big man, the big man. Let's see what Vergos can do in the Premier League, boys. He was bullying those defenders in the championship. And Vergos does it again. Vergos does it again. 2-2. <laughs> to think that I almost subbed this guy out when we have a fucking corner kick for once. All right, we have our first ever corner kick, and it's about to sub out Vegas. <laughs> and it works. It doesn't matter if the Premier League or the Championship. This guy leaps above everyone. The strength, the jump in. Look at that. Three defenders on him. He says he guys, he guys are nothing. He's like a fucking build into a tree. What? Lovely delivery comes in. Alfonso Davies scrambling. Mancini um, scrambling. But Vegas says, I, I got it. I got this, boys. Two, two, boys. Game on. Game on. This has been quite the Sit down, the United. Ride. Look, I don't want to skip the draw. For I don't want to play an, an additional leg. Great tackle and do Lewis Miller, man. Oh, Veg Horse. Veg Horse. Ben Madre. Ah, oh, Veg Horse. Anthony now. comes in for Sancho. For Ilanga. Now we got manual, man. Oh, lovely tackle by Mukoko. Bam! Bagos! Yes! <laughs> you ain't stopping the big man. Premier League defenders, bring them on. Bring them on. Maybe Van Dyke will give him, give him some troubles. But lovely win that by Mukoko. Delivery on time, on, on target. Amazon Prime delivery. And Mukoko, I mean, Virgo says, I see it. I will deal with it. Lovely delivery. Look at the neck muscles on that. Dabby Dabby here. Stuffed with the head of it. That's what good head does to your man. Yes, he knows it. He knows it, boys. 3 2. What a, what a turnaround by Burnley. You can't really say Jeremy Frank Pong. Come on. See out the win. See out the win. Lovely delivery. Yes. Comfortable save for Hondanovic. And there goes the fourth time whistle. And 3 2 for Burnley at Old Trafford. United have been stunned here at Old Trafford. And Burnley goes through to the next round of the EFL Cup. <laughs> I was this close to subbing out Vegas because he wasn't doing shit. Two great crosses, two headers. <laughs> That's it. That's it, boys. It's so freaking easy, man. Oh my gosh. I fucking love this guy. Doesn't matter if it's the Premier League, doesn't matter if the championship or whatever league Vegas is Vegas is gonna bully defenders absolutely bullying defenders yeah Terry here got stuffed with the head of that you couldn't even save it you couldn't even save United boys well that's a massive win by the way that's a big win <laughs> we still got a lot of top teams in the competition though but that's a very big win we'll take those we'll take those and then we have Arsenal in just a couple of days boys we are knocking we are so tired man this will be a test of character because we have chose okay it's a long break before we take on I me. Mean, five days before we take on Chelsea. I just realized that we're not in any European competition. Did we get Conference League last last year? Oh, we did we bottle it? I think we might have bottle it, boys. I think we might have bottle it. Uh, but let's go and just. I mean, we're not looking too. Good. We're not looking too tired actually. Uh, but we got Arsenal coming up, boys, at Turf Moor. Um, thinking I'm going. I'm thinking we're going with a four four two again, boys. Jennifer back in the club. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go with the 4 2 boys. They got awesome men now. Arsenal, very good team. Odegaard, Ceballos, Gavi as well. Vieira, Seika. Uh, very good team. Very, very good team. But looking, listen, listen, listen. We, from that win against United at Old Trafford, anything is possible. Bring on Arsenal, boys. We got the Hulk. Very good. <laughs> Smeller. 
Luis Miller. Talk about CDM. I'm playing two CDMs, boys. We're playing very, very defensive. 4 4 2, Burnley style. How about the cross? Oh, we're getting carved up in now by Arsenal. We're getting carved up in now by Arsenal. Iseka. Oh, we're getting carved up in now by Arsenal. Man, fuck this game, boys. Ah, oh, we're getting carved up in, man. The one touch pass and they're just, just so intricate with this. Like, I go to you, you back to me, back to him, back to me. in the back of the net, man. We couldn't keep it. My eyes can only see so many pixels on the so many pixels on the screen, man. I mean, look at this. One touch, bang, 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 bang. I mean, that's that's this Arsenal, man. Come on, Burnley. Ah. Uh, don't dive in. Oh. Somehow Handanovic kept that out. <laughs> I don't trust Handanovic, man. I feel like he's gonna let goals in too easily. But somehow, some way, he let he kept that out. Mukoko, fantastically well. Out wide now to Genepo. Genepo. Genepo is not it. That's my next. That's my next transfer at the club. Genepo is not it, boys. That's the next transfer at the club. I'm probably gonna start Manuel Benson in Elanga. Oh, Jason, you had him. Yes, Jason. Wonderful challenge. And a throw yes, Jason. Up. Oh, Gavi. Vieira. Oh, good block. No! No piss off this game, man. We're going to absolutely run through by Arsenal. Look at telling he's a sub already. Oh no, boys, we're getting ran through by Arsenal. They're too good to keep up with them here. I mean, luckily deflection, to be honest. I mean, how did he just run right through there with Jason standing in front of him, man? 2 0 down to Arsenal in 38 minutes. This could be a long day. One added minute added to the to the four time whistle, boys. I mean, what are we doing? Oh, off the line. Off the line. Oh, goodness me, off the post. And that's going to be all for this game. There won't be too many happy We're so bad, dude. We're just so bad, man. Oh my god. Honestly, we couldn't lay a glove on Arsenal. They were miles better than us. This is like this is really like a championship team against a Premier League team. This was so bad. The gap was so huge. I'm pressing the controllers and we can't even get close to Arsenal. We have probably one shot the whole game. The whole game is all Arsenal. I don't get it. we had one shot the whole game. The whole fucking game. Look at the stats. One shot totally of ten. They got all the passes, all the... I mean, it just makes sense. We, we couldn't do... I, I basically went into that game and just, just let my control that I just watched Ashton play. That's basically what happened. Uh, we're not that bad. That's why I'm pissed off, man. Oh, we got Chelsea coming up next now, so hopefully we can get a bounce back. And now we should not have Chelsea coming up now, boys. We're lying seven, Chelsea lying six, but only 11 points. So that's a massive game in terms of who goes above their friends. I mean, Bronny with 11 points, Chelsea 11 points, Spurs with 11 points as well. And it's at the stand for a bridge. Um, you know what, yeah. You know what? I'm not really enjoying Jennifer so much, boys. I'm actually gonna go ahead and start Manuel Benson in it. I'm not really enjoying Jennifer. I kinda wanna give Carson also a goal, but we keep Mukoko in it. It's very, very pacey. Uh, so we're gonna go with that team, boys. Hopefully it doesn't gash us up. That's the Chelsea team that playing a 5-2-3 with Moreno, ZH, Pulisic, Christian Pose, like Tonali, Mason Mouse, for Fana Kuluba. That's a hard team. We have to go for for two boys. They're packing the boss. We have to go two strikers up there to try and give that five center, three center backs. A run for the money, but it's going to get this game going then against a Chelsea. Oh, James, try not to. Yes, good defending. Yeah, there goes the full time whistle. It's now, I mean, half time whistle, boys. It's now a 1 0 lead here. Um, I mean, it's 0 0 between Chelsea and Burnley boys with 45 minutes left to play. Both teams have only one shot so far. <laughs> Talk about a boring game, but that's what happens when you play five in the back. Boys. Everyone's trying to make that first goal. We'll see, we get that first goal in the second half, boys, and that's on the way. It's just, oh, lovely play! Lovely play! Lovely play! Oh, take the corner! Yes, Bagors! Yes, we'll take the corner. Oh. Oh. <laughs> We'll take the corner game, boys. Our only chance to score. Where's Bagwards, man? Where's Bagwards? There he is. There he is. Our only chance to try and get something in this game has to come from a corner kick. Bagwards. Yes! Come on! Amazing scenes here. Our only chance in this game was to come from corner kick, boys. 
You have one shot on target. Corner kick comes from it, and Bergwood scores. <laughs> Look at him leap. Oh, get in the mud, Mendy. Mendy comes out. When you come out of your goal like that, you should be punching and clearing everyone. Mendy is too late. Bergwood is already in the air. He heads it above behind Mendy into the back of the net. But no Premier League defenders can handle him. Mastermind. Oh, it's working, boys. Vagors, Hoot. Hoot, Vagors. Come on. His first goal in the Premier League. But this season, boys. Come on, Vagors. That's how you do it. That's how It's going to end a boring game. We finally scored a goal. Four minutes left to hang on to for this, for this win, boys. Four minutes left. Chelsea didn't score in, in, in 85 minutes. I don't think they can score in four. There it is again. Hoot. Let's go! Get the balls out wide. Whip the cross in for the Amazon Prime delivery and let Hoot Vegas deal with it. He's never getting subbed off. <laughs> well, here it is again. Lovely it's play. A cross comes in. Distance. What a delivery. Yeah, Amazon Prime delivery. Kante? Kante's getting the muddled again. And so Mendy. He, he's going one way, he's going the next way. Look at Kante. There's no way Kante wins that. Oh, what a header. Look at what Vegas does. He doesn't attach himself to Kulubadi or Kuludadi. He attaches himself to Kante, the smaller guy. <laughs> Chelsea are so ready. They're playing Kante center back. <laughs> and Wood Vegas has destroyed him. He has absolutely destroyed them here today the at the Central cool Bridge. Alright, guys. So, my dumbass didn't realize that my camera was blurred after we scored a second goal against Chelsea. And I recorded the rest of the episode for the blurred camera. But it wasn't too far off the end anyway. Well, that was the last um, game to end the episode. But basically, a recap is we won 2 nick against Chelsea Boys. So, you guys see, they just didn't come back. They don't really want to come back. Two last minute goals for Virgo Sports with the, two, with the two chances we had. The game was very, very boring. First half was dead. Second half, we scored two goals from Bregos and we won the game. And that was basically uh, uh, all to it. I was just about to end the episode and the camera was blurred. So I post edit. I was editing this and I realized, holy shit, my camera was blurred. Uh, so this is the post edit. Anyway, we won Chelsea 2 0. We're going to move on to the next episode, boys. So don't forget to like and subscribe if you're new as well. Now try and bring the next episode coming very, very soon. Thank you for watching again and take care.